Hey YouTube, what's going on? It's Melro back with uh, day three of the race level 300. Uh, Crib's not going to be in this episode because of, of uh, family dinner he's having, so I'm like, no problem by me. It's like I'd rather him be uh, do that. It's like to me, it's like if you're gonna record with me, if especially after Crossbow comes out, if you if you let me know in advance, like uh, like I will say this right off the bat, like you know, like like you can't do something. I'm like. It don't bother me as long as you, as long as you tell me in advance, I don't have to deal with the. I don't as long as I'm not scrambling to fill last minute positions or something like that. It's okay. I could do a solo episode once in a while. It's like, so it's no biggie. Uh, but returning this job to Trey Rick. We got ourselves a real life hero. And now he wants to be. Automatic weapons handbook volume seven. I'm going into that so. Aiming from the hip with greater accuracy can save your ass close quarters situations. I am gladly taking that. So, and book series, machine gunner, automatic weapons handbook. It's called. Yeah, hip fire accuracy is greatly increased. So, one key to the book. We have. And we got a zombie outside. Hello, hello. Pretty cold night. I saw a wandering horde room past the little base. Didn't do much base work, but I was like, I just wanted to kind of chill out. You, you may notice I'm getting a little bit more XP than in previous episodes. That's because I, I've noticed in like uh, co-op, it's like uh, you ta you actually take less XP when sharing it, it's like, which to me, it's like, it's not that big of a deal, like, because I do get a little bit more XP, but say if, like, we were doing this for a full-on, uh, hey, look, an anvil. But, ooh, tier 2 stone axe. If, you know, doing that stuff, it would be, it would basically be a, you know, it's like, I think the shared part makes a lot more, makes up a lot more than that, so. Searching up the compound here. In case you did miss it, we did take a. I did, like, briefly walk into the wasteland biome. Scrap you up and turn you into. And you are my new stone axe. So. Treyrek, do you have anything fun for me? You basically have just jobs to the... You have another buried spot. I'm not taking that. I... It's like, I like having a bit more pay in my dukes here, so... I'm gonna make you an um, offer you can't refuse. Or, you since I mentioned... The moment I laid eyes on you. Since I mentioned the wasteland, we could go a little spicy. The wasteland's the hardest biome in the game. I'm thinking could potentially go into go and see if we could find Trader Joel in the wasteland and and see if we could get a tier one wasteland job from him. Could it could wind up very badly for me? You know, like me getting punched in the face a few times. But I'm thinking that you know, could. We could really shake things up with the old sauce bottle there, so... Um... I'm not gonna cut this out, like... I want you guys to experience it. It's not gonna be... I don't think it's gonna be quite as bad as the old, um... As the old Legacy version. Like, I don't think it's gonna be quite that bad. So... Um... Just carry a little bit of stuff on me. This could either go very well or very poorly for me. So. I said I wasn't going to cut it, but. How far is that wasteland over? Ah, it's just down the road. Yeah, we'll walk over. Nice misty morning. And you can see the sun glowing through the, uh, through the horizon. This game is so pretty. I do want to remind you, you got this. 
Thank you, Stove. Uh, speaking of which, I was gonna just say if you if you want to watch like you know, episodes of this early or you just want to see uncut stuff, check out the link in the description below for my Twitch channel because I am streaming this on Twitch Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. I usually do about three episodes at a time. We are already in the wasteland, so make sure we don't have any extra challenges. Um, actually, you know what? I was thinking to myself, we'll do, let's actually do a couple challenges, just to, just to do a couple, you know, like, get, I'm missing out on sweet, sweet XP, so. Give me a bedroll. I like my MB pure and uncut. <laughs> Thank you, Stove. I like my MB <laughs> pure and uncut. <laughs> Gives you more watch time. Uh, Spike's trap. Here we go. Um, just grab me that. And I can immediately pick that up. And. Give you that. And... And I could just stay there. Knowing my luck, I'll probably kind of walk right back into it. But, nah. So... 300 XP, 300 XP. We're 300 XP, but not too bad. We can make some extra later. Short-term XP gain. Keep in mind, loot bonuses boosted fairly substantially. Oh, I found a car battery. And, like, let's just take a look at this. Like, because it's such an early game. So, Pine Forest, we'll take a look here. Go into stats. Um, loot stage is 15. Go into Wasteland. Loot stage 67. So, this is a significant boost to loot stage is, so... We could get some pretty kind of spicy rewards early on, so I'm gonna search cars. I know Krim said in the last episode he could see the Wasteland City. I'm just gonna follow the road. I think I'll probably fast forward through this footage for you until we come up to engine. Oh, wow. So, yeah, I'm gonna do that and We'll see where this takes us, guys. So I'll catch up to you just a little bit. Oh, dog! Never mind. I wasn't. I'm not. Nope. <laughs> Alrighty then. Well, that's good news for me because I'm looking for leather. Thankfully, the dogs for me, to me, they're not. They're not that threatening. Or leather. Big Mama. How would you like your bone knife? Uh, uh. Ah, great, mister. Big Mama's gonna be a tough cookie to crack. Come here. There you go, 2250 XP. Did I have any skill points to spend? That's the question. I have one to spend, so we're gonna go into Brawler and there we go, we might pull a brawler book out. Or some... Or some healing cream. Um, this is... Looking like it's not immediately going into... Considering you have killed like a million zombie dogs, you shouldn't be scared of them anymore, lol. That is a good point, Stove. I guess it's just, uh, good old, you know, fear of them from Legacy version, that's why. It looks like it's kind of going... fluctuating. Hello, big guy. Yeah. If I could stop with my shots with bows, that would be excellent. Come here. I will take... I will take your... take your... yeah, you know, take arrows out of your head and reuse them. Legacy dogs were definitely worse. Yes. Oh, if you people don't know, like, you're watching them, the you know, like start watching me and after this version released it is like go go back and watch one of my videos like 
somewhere like uh, where you'll see the where you'll see the old uh, lazy dogs. They were obnoxious to say the least. Looks like there's a another dog over there. Um, let's try to take him out because I need leather. A little low, I believe. Enter burnt forest. It's complete. Uh, one shot on the dog. So yeah, this is weird. Like a little bit of enter burnt forest and back and. Ooh. Could be interesting. I was gonna go into the wasteland, but depending on what tier this POI is, I might go and look at it. Come here. Hey, blood out. What tier are you? Mercy Point Camp. Um. You know what? I'll see if I can find this wasteland town, guys. So. Let me fast forward the footage actually this time. Catch you once we find something. Well, everybody, so I'm going to stop the time-lapse here. I haven't seen any wasteland. I, when Krim said hmm, he could see the wasteland city somewhere, like, uh, like, I don't know what direction he was going because, um, I did get another skill point, but it might be to the south. I'm not exactly sure. Like, we ran into burnt forest and all that. Uh, that's a bear. But it's like, yo, it could be... I'd have to ask him next time we play, like, yo. Figured, might as well at least take advantage of the... That's purple. I can kind of see the purple a little bit, but I'm like, you're calling that purple? Do we want to take on a bear? That looks like a small one, but... Probably chew my butt. Oh, great. I probably just spelled death for me. Hey! Level 1 Bone Knife versus Bear. We are not doing a level 1 Bone Knife versus Bear. But hey, I actually shot him! Nice! This is. I, I think this is the baby bear, so. Got first animals complete. Well, I can keep in mind I'm playing on it tonight. There you go. Yeah, good source of meat. I know I'm playing on adventurer, and I'm like, I'm like, still like a bear should not be taken lightly as a threat on, on day day three. I'm already taking enough of a risk as is. So, um, more glue, more plastic. I'll gladly take it. The the dogs at least have been proven make, making me uh, good good old fashioned uh, give me leather. Ow! Got bleeding. Got bleeding. Ah, uh, great. There we go. Go away, bird. Oh. 
Not gonna complain about free feathers. Okay. I know the bleeding wasn't good, but still not a bad thing. We're still alive, so if I could, I would be playing the uh, "Staying Alive" song, but can't do that for YouTube reasons. Um, Mr. Businessman, how would you like to have a word with me? Here, you get your arrow hammered in and then pulled right back out after you're you know, dead. Hermit Hollow. We can loot this. Uh, take your face off. It's a no star. Oh, 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 staying alive, staying alive. <laughs> hey, if you wind up get me and get me a copyright story code or copyright claim from that, like uh, there's a difference between those. But the stove, it's all your fault. <laughs> oh. But, um, just some basic loot. They can sue me. <laughs> oh, military zombie. Hello, senor. Oh, I thought maybe the arrow would still be sticking out of his hat. So we could have a unicorn soldier. At least there's some books in here. Oop. You're not good enough for my 762s. There we go. Got a couple arrows back out of him. And... Harvest this firewood up and see what we get for books. Forge ahead, I'll save that for Krim later. Armored it up. Perimeter, perimeter quality armor 5. Bl Alright, there, there's a bunch of words for you. I will drink that red tea, because that is good for that. And we got a shamway box. Hey, hey. Not gonna complain about loot. Southern farming. I've unlocked I've unlocked cotton seeds. I mean, well, I guess I can start farming up uh farming up uh, cloth sometime soon. We'll read this last car over here and then probably actually take a job for Trey Erect. Eh, not not the best loot, but I I guess you could say it is the best loot because it is from the wasteland, but not too bad around here. I know it'll probably get more chaotic, but what would be nice though would be if, is if uh, one of these zombies would drop me a, a loot bag here in the wasteland because that would be really good because of the higher game stage. Uh, or loot stage. Is this going to be a level 300 run? Yes, it is, so that's the whole. That's why it's named the stream. Th why this whole series is named the Race to Level 300. Which, you know, like, several things will help out. Learning elixir, learn elixirs, um... Oh, I missed that. And... Boop! Another... You know, Vulture Bites of Dust. And... There you go. Try to unloot these two. Be really quick, but it's like, learn elixirs, but... Another thing can really do, if you really felt like it, if you really feel like it, you know, can go crazy on maximizing XP, guys, is like, is, so, this is in ties with the, the, um, where is it? The Night Stalker series. It is Night Stalker Volume 6. If you get Volume 6, you get 5% more XP at night, and say, you know, I would recommend this be like a late game, later game strategy, but you could take the daylight hours it's set on 18 by default, and you could crank down the, you could just basically minimize the, the daylight hours, and then basically, like, I don't know how low it goes, but you could basically have, like, Fanks told me about it, where you could just have, like, super long horde nights, and, uh, because horde night zombies do get the nighttime bonus XP when, while you're fighting on horde night, so, if you really felt like maximizing it, it's just one of those, like, you know, which might do, like, once we kind of get better set up. Almost a Trader Rex. 
Interesting, a little bit of uh, looting for the day, though. How much leather did I even wind up with? Twenty-seven leather. Pro tip of the day. Yeah, there you go. Pro tip of the day. And it's like some people would be like, "Oh, five percent XP isn't that much," but it's like, well, if you think about it this way, like, especially on three hundred percent XP, like five percent XP per zombie at night, it, it's like every zombie is worth twelve hundred XP at least because they're and so let's just say you would be getting like an extra 60 xp i want to say yeah i would say like 1260 xp per zombie at night and it's like that may not seem like a much but it's like yes because thank you for confirming uh because it would be worth a because like that xp adds up quickly on a Fortnite, because you'd be taking out so many zombies. You come into my shop. Don't Let me test check my your it's thinner than books your real quick. Um, you have a couple... Okay, we're gonna have to take this. Urban Combat Volume 5. Great book to have in the game. Don't have to worry about land me stepping on landmines. That doesn't... That doesn't account for the zombies' so stupidity, but that's a great book to have a roll on by those you cheap those tackle warfare ones. Bitch. That's all you're gonna buy. Um, we'll take this clear hey, zombies to the west. Need some work? Get Crow moving, jackass. This don't pay by the hour. Huh. <sighs> so, I'll meet you over there, but let's see if we got anything good. Just wait for the just wait for the game to catch up a little bit. I'm very hungry. Yeah, whatever. Um, yeah, yeah, game. Come on, do we? Work? <laughs> this game's taking forever. I apologize, guys. I believe we should. Have... There we go. Pipe machine gun quality four. So, I'll meet you over that job. Alrighty, everybody. So coming up on job here, and turns out I. The reason why this is the jobs were so far to the west is because there's an actual town over here. Shotgun Messiah is the first thing we kept uh, come up on. As you can see, I have the knuckle wraps. Unfortunately, I could only make tier one, but that's okay. Not, not a biggie. It's like I did get another skill point on the way over, and I did invest my previous one into two out of five brawlers, so we're gonna go three out of five. I really want these books, so. We're at Mario Piper. Might as well loot these books here. And if anybody feels like making themselves known, I will give them the old ham sandwiches here. Come here. Knock them down immediately. See you later. And. Also, don't forget to grab myself some extra plastics here. And. Dilute the old school bus. I don't know, like, uh, I made the base, like, you know, kind of as just a, you know, temporary little means of, uh, having, you know, just, just somewhere to save, because, like, literally spawned right by that trader wreck. I think there might be another one here in town, so. We might move over here. Um... Is this the one I'm thinking of with a with a little box of goodies with ammunition in here? If it is, I will definitely will loot this again. Loot this ammunition box. I'm not against the double the Meyer stuff. Our ammunition's box. Seven six twos and all the and all the goodies. Also, can't forget the mailbox. Hey, bar brawling. Which one? Hang on. Oh, I took your arm off. Come here. Boop. There we go. Alright. Bar Brawling Volume 2. Drop a bomb. Sprinting power attacks have a high chance of knocking down your opponent. Which reminds me, like, Bar Brawling is going to be a great series. It's going to be great because, along with Automatic Whip and this handbook. Hey! Harvest and Cobblestone's complete. What was that part of? Um, harvest rod meat's done. Might as well claim those. 
But yeah, it's just one of those, like, uh, you know, guys will compliment my main stuff here. So, break right back into this for the munitions box. Never have enough ammunition in a zombie apocalypse. There we go. And what do you have? Rival world. I'll just read that just for the hell of it. All right. Zombies, come on in. I'm trying. I want to try out this new skill here. So, unfortunately, didn't do it for him, but. Hang on. Search the trash. I don't usually do sprinting power attacks that much, but it could be fun. More wood and flesh. Ah, you won't come. Ow. Ah! Try to get up a little bit here. And... I oh, usually attack rage on these, so... Ow. Um, pipe machine gun. One of the times, like, I uh, probably shouldn't be playing with the zombies. I'm looking with my fists, so. Do, 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 nothing in here. Search up this here for that, uh, and. No, no. Uh. Trash. Cobblestone, take it. And. Rotten flesh. You know, it's the same old, same old here. Ooh, cooking grill. Very nice. Yeah, we got bones, all the good stuff here. And. Where are these good for? Good for wood or something else? Complaining about the reach of your arms, LNFO. <laughs> well, I'm not used to the short attack range on these. Yeah. Hello! How can I help you? Face cave in? Nice. Thank you. Uh, punch that door in. You're punchy. Boop. And thank you. And search our loot here. That is. Ooh, melee weapon damage. That is medium armor. I'll actually scrap the old armor for that. And. Don't know if there's anything up there. I'll actually grab you for leather. Um, there you go. What do you have in the old book pile? Anything fun? Gravedigger schematic. And I'll just scrap that barbed wire because I'm not really into clubs. So, uh, ammo pile. Nice. Am I actually looking to this? a little bit more, see if we can find a trader wreck or something like that. Because I might potentially move here, because just for the sake of convenience. This looks like... roaming horde here? Pop you... No. Bad zombie. Boop. Open your minds a little bit. Stop thinking so negatively. Curious fist. Knuckle wraps quality too, nice. And pop you. Come on. Boop. And Bam. You the eye of the tiger. Eye of the tiger. Oh boy, music references to this episode. Boop. There's skill point. You lost your arm. And, you know what? Four out of five. We're, we're going for the whole set. Bam! And... What does this give me for level four? I believe this... 
Yeah. 20 stamina of him for taking out a zombie. My fist gains stamina from taking down zombies. Here to here. Um, well, then we're gonna upgrade to the old knuckles, to the new knuckles, right away. Zombie, you're in trouble now. Bam! Oh, I love having a nice upgrade. Passing gas store number eight. There's the dead rooster. Across the street, we got vehicle adventures. Um, I think we might actually just kind of spend the rest of the day looting this town, so. Well, as it's like, I can, I know Krim has another quest to do over, kind of by, you know, over, way over to the east, but it's okay. Um, give me that. Um, I would rather, I would like to have my 762s and my arrows. Thank you. Anything in the pumps here? And... Where? Ah. Oh well. Nice little headshot on you. And I will... Hey, I give free arrows for you, so... Took him down with a punch to punch to the arm. He is really he must be really weak from that. I'm not this is like I was gonna make a joke, but search these up for hey, pure mill water. Actually drink that right now. Some of the best water you can get early game. And anything. There might be a puppy. Someone wants to have work. I missed the shot. And there you go. Very convincing. Opening a lot of mines. I could see you over there. Sneak shot. I missed. I'll go for center mass here. See you later. And I think there's crawlers down here. So. Whew. Okay. Yep, there's crawlers. Come here. Come here, you guys. Chew. Ow. Please don't. Alright, I think that's the... POI clear. Not a hard POI to clear up. Forgot about the collapses, but. Uh. Passing gas. Anything good out of you? Anything good for me? And. We got. Let's scrap and funds. Gasoline. The main stash. Bar Brawling Volume 6. After getting hit, brawling attacks are 20% faster and increase movement speed by 10%. And tier four knuckle wraps. So, got two upgrades in one day. Like, uh, I guess three if you count me initially crafting my my leather knuckles. So, making good progress on me. And more various bunches. Doop. And get some more plastic going. I always have more plastic. I think this is just paper stuff. I don't know why I'm mining it up, but... There's also a bit of loot on top of the place. Do 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 And... Got some steel knuckles parts already, so... If I unlock tier knuckles, uh, steel knuckles, my... My wording. Uh, then I might be able to unlock some good stuff. Ah, I sprained my leg. Quiet, you. Don't need you making fun of me. Atlas Medico, I believe that's a tier 3. I can see more zombies. A roam of the joint. I would like to see if there is a... another... traitor, so... 
Neither of this is trader rack. Also, mailboxes. I don't know why the game proceeds to think I need explosives. I I love I love explosives game, but I don't always need this. All those cabinet, we got ATM. All those cabinet is tier two. Um, I said I was gonna look for trigger wrecked. Ah, oh, might as well. Come here. Punch, punch. I walk into a POI and I just start taking down zombies. I can't help it. And more pipes. Uh, not really looking much. It can't be that bad. Books. More. F Ooh, two more furious fists. Gets us a little bit further. Come here. I say that hard hat ain't protecting you too well. Oh, there, amigo. Tier three knuckle wraps, and we got a maintenance worker there. Ah, a little bit short. Get us a little bit of bonus damage. And... Come here. Boop. And. Two crits in a row. Come on. Boop. Three zombies critted. Come on in. Bit of vitamins. What do you got in the toolbox? Nada. Work. Work bridge that destroyed. Tier 2 stone shovel, which I'll gladly take. It's an upgrade nonetheless. And a medical cabinet. Steroids, which I'll gladly take. It decreases my... Decreases my... Where were those painkillers when I needed them? Earlier? And go for like two days straight. Boop. See you later. Take care of your girlfriend. We got another skill point. You know what that means. Tier 5. Oh. Tier 5 Nux. Bad. I could deal with water later. I'd, I'd rather not be in, injured. This is man. Knocked him off the ladder. See you later. Any zombies. Got the lady. Bad luck on the Oh. Why are you... How are you hitting me? You jerk. Little punk. There. Well, that's the eldest cabinet's complete, and we'll just break into this. <sighs> oh, I'm lucky the knuckles already. Takes a little bit to beat on the on the chunky monkeys, but hey, it's part of the fun of the game. Do 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 do. Shamway. and ooh, intellect mod. Spear Hunter Volume 6, I'll just read that. Probably save those other books for Krim. And... Alright. Mm. Don't know if I want to set up, set up shop somewhere, but... I'll go down and put some stuff in the box and... Kind of... Tune in once I'm back on the street. Oh, birds! Go away. Um, I was about to say I was gonna cut away, but all right. I'll check with you if I find a tree wrecked. Well, so, well, once I'm done putting stuff away.
Take that. And... Well, I've already sorted through my, well, I made another storage box and, uh, ran through everything here. You know, I just, I'm like, let me just dump stuff out, and it's like, got another bike. Big money, big biker. What'd you say to me? Hmm? Come here. This guy. Look at this guy. This guy this does not kid around. Um, cruise through, see if there's any mailboxes available. Just some paper. Boo, paper. Paper's not useful to me right now. We got fungi daycare. Seen that one before. Um, we can at least raid the mailbox for He was it. talking smack about your mom. Eh. That's why you got the knuckles. And... Do, 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 do. Take care of this big guy. <laughs> Land the smackdown on zombies. I might be in the wrong area. That looks like black... Yep, black bus. Um, we got Jericho Ranch. It's near night time now, so... And... That guy is a dead one. I see a chicken. Or paper. Uh, we'll keep roaming for a little bit longer here. We see big boy here. Oh. He, an officer, he ran into my fists. Yeah, I don't see a traitor over here. I mean, it is raining, so at least, at the very least, it's not... It's not just, uh, as if, even if weather was, I guess, it's not too bad, like, it wouldn't be too warm. Did I hear a crawler? Yes, I did. Oh, well, he's... that's a dead crawler. Um, anybody else roaming around? Hmm. Anybody else want to taste the fists before night time? Because there will probably be ferals running around here, so. Sharp sticks. That's the stone spear quality, too. Not too big into that. Kostecki residence. Um. Even though it's about to end, let's let's check on this and check on Crispy Kitchen. Cause I believe there's there might be a web bag in here. Could be good. I know it's nighttime, but all right. Zombies are a little bit quicker. She got taken out by being smacked in the butt. Uh, cupboard. Uh, sham sandwich. Key rack. Soda fountain. No. This shouldn't take too long. Ow. Probably gonna get pretty dark here. See you later. Somebody's. Somebody. 
See you later. Yep, somebody else got in here. See you later, and... See you later. Level 20. That looks like a shamway box. <sighs> that is a bit of tuna, so I'm shelving and gotta look for the the fuego. The fuego fuego. Say so as long as I don't get burnt, I'm gonna be happy. Red red valve, so yeah, it's a remnant, but it's a... But we get a weapons bag out of the deal. Weapons bag... Pipe pistol. Not bad. So I'll read that. Yeah, wooden club. Wooden club quality 3. So yeah, I'm going to call this an episode, guys. Very happy with the progress I've made here. Even without Krim, you know, like... Love having him. It's just like... You know, but sometimes you can't have everyone on for all, for all the stuff. If you like what you see and you want to see more from, uh, from me, uh, please leave a like, comment, subscribe down below, and helps the channel out so much. Have a good one, and take care.